All right, what's going on YouTube? John here with Dig That Beat. Mike, here. And we're gonna do a wrap up of everything we found at the Honey Hole. Um, it was a really good permission. We had some agreements with the landowner. Um, the property was soon going under development and we had permission to metal detect there until that happened. Well, development started and we're no longer allowed to go back out there. But we're gonna go over everything we found kind of briefly. Charlie got some stuff out there too, a big toy truck, a marble, two silver, some wheats, a few little odds and ends. But we're gonna show you everything the three of us got. So starting down here, just a whole bunch of toys. The only really cool ones would be a Tootsie toy here. And I got the General Lee and Boss Hog uh, Dukes of Hazard matching cars there. Got some little miscellaneous. Didn't one other car come out of there that would have to do that? Maybe. I know there's a bunch of cars that's not here that was dug there. Yeah. But I can't remember. But I do know these two were dug the same day. Um, I don't know what that is. It's kind of like a button or come off a couch or something. I'm not sure. Makeup compact lid, a little charm. Good many keys. This one's a Sansonite. I got one marble. Vintage fishing lure. Another little locket type thing with a heart on it. This little charm here. I just knew that was going to be silver. But it turned out not to be plated. Only plated. Um, little cuff link. Two little hair pins. Three tokens here. This is a naughty token. Presidential token. And that's a play coin. A 50 cent piece. I got one, two, three foreign coins up here. I got 13 silvers. The biggest one I got was the last trip out there. I got a Washington quarter. And then right here, I got 96 sweet pennies. So a lot of stuff come out of that place. These guys here have mostly their coins. Um, they don't have all the other stuff that they dug out there. Your uh, grandson got most of your cars, yeah, didn't he? Yeah, one of my grandbabies got all the cars. Cool. And then Gary didn't listen to the assignment. <laughs> and he only brought us coins because he had to go dig back through pictures to know what he got from out there. But anyways, Mike, show him what you got. I got, um, this thing on? Yeah, it should be. I got 82, 81, 81 wheat pennies. The little car, I had more. Grandbaby got them all. And I had the other stuff, but I don't know what happened to it. I'd still save it, I guess. I got the skeleton key. Not so old. I got um, memorial shot up, or no, like nails hammered through it. Yeah, interesting. Canadian penny from '61. <clears throat> this button. I don't know what it stands for. It, it was thing. military yeah. related. Yeah, it was military. Got this little silver ring, sterling ring. B deck. Dog tag from '45. You know, I thought all dog tags were been copper or brass back yeah, in 45 uh -huh. but that's that's pretty cool anyway silver got a silver nickel uh six mercury dimes seven roses and three quarters of another one two washington's one slq no date franklin 52 it's a good find yeah can't tell if it's got it yeah anyway and uh that's pretty much it other than the the uh relics i didn't bring i didn't bring no relics we got 49 wheat pennies it's one short of a full roll five mercury dimes one roosevelt dime a little silver military pin washington franklin another franklin man. Yep. and a lee nickel and yeah i left all my because we got a dog tag. Her dog tag is older than mine, I think. We got yeah. a dog tag out there, several Tootsie toys out yeah, there. Cool and, uh, but like John awesome. said, I didn't listen to the assignment. So <laughs> So all in all, that was an amazing permission. The Charlie um, found what? He got two silvers, a big old Tootsie toy truck, a marble, and some wheat. Yep. Yeah, really nice truck. So yeah. over 250 wheat pennies, 43 pieces of silver. There's more out there, but I feel we got a majority of the easy Not to get anymore. stuff. Yeah. <laughs> But um, it's being developed and we can't go back out there while that's going on. But I, I feel like we did get a lot of the stuff that was easy to get, um, which is pretty awesome. So we don't get places like that often. When you run across them, they're always a pleasant treat because almost every trip you get stuff and that, and that doesn't happen often. So, mm -hmm. But please check us out on Patreon. It does help us out making the videos. We just wanted to give a wrap up on this to kind of touch base with you guys on what's going on with it. But uh, I sell motor detectors and equipment. If you need that kind of stuff, let me know. I'll save you some money. 
But if you enjoy these videos, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. That's right. Mike the bell. Alright, peace.